Hey everyone, we're here today just to do a really quick video on something. Um, I was watching Clay Harrell's uh, Pinball Ninja site, and he put these little like LEDs on all his like boards and stuff like that to show how much voltage is coming off the board if it's dropping or not. So instead of putting a voltmeter, you get an instant like num, you know, instant voltage to tell you what's coming off your board. So I install these on all my games, uh, pretty much all my Williams games. So it tells me just to quickly, you know, take a quick glance if it's at five volts or if it's dropping below it or if I'm going to have, uh, you know, like resets in my game, stuff like that. So basically, um, just going over that and to just show like the wiring of how it's wired up. So um, I have, there's a, mine's a three wire uh, LED little display here. They come in two and three. So I have the three wire one. So let's turn the, just the, uh, the, the, what do you call it on here? The light, just so you could get a better look at the uh, back box here. So, um, as you can see, there's a red, white, and black wire that come off that LED. So the black wire goes to a little resistor up there, R200, and it goes on the right-hand side that I soldered it to. Um, I don't know if I can kind of get in there to see it. But, yeah, it's like right there. So that black wire goes to the right side of that resistor. And then there's a red and white wire that come off the LED. Or else, yeah, the, uh, the display here. And that goes to TP2. And I just put like a dab of solder. You could just leave it there. And then I just Velcroed the, uh, with like a Velcro button or a dot to the board. I didn't want to, you know, put anything on the board or nothing in case I want to take it off quickly. So I just put that on there. But, um, but yeah, it's kind of cool. It's just a quick, like, little readout of, um, you know, your pinball machine, if the power is dropping or not. So, you know, again, it's just wired with three wires, but two wires go to one part, and then that black wire just goes to that little uh, resistor. I believe it's A200. Or is it R200? It might be R200, I'm sorry. So it's R200, and it goes on the right-hand side of that, and that's your negative, or your ground, and the power you know you get off your uh, TP2 next to your 12 volt over there, the little stud that comes out. So that's it, that's just a quick, little quick video I wanted to show of that. Again, I put it on all my games. I put it on my WPC95s, my Fliptronics, my Fliptronics 2s. Um, so it's a kind of a cool little thing to do. I'll put the parts list on my uh, my blog. I'll do a link from this video on the bottom of my YouTube video to the uh, blog post, and then you could take a look at it for yourself and uh, order the parts if you want to do this. Okay, so here we are now on a WPC95 game, and it's Safe Cracker. And it's hooked up the same way. The board format is a little bit different on this game than it was on the uh, Twilight Zone game that I have. And the red and white line go to TP101, and the black line goes kind of under that to ground. It says GND. So it kind of, there's a specific ground uh, connector for your wire for this. Not like on the uh, the Twilight Zone where you had to kind of put it to a little uh, like a transistor on there, a resistor on the board, and that was your ground. But uh, let's just turn the light on so we could kind of see it better. And again, the red and white go to TP101, which is to the left, and right under that is your ground connector, you know, for your other line for that little display. So again, it tells you. Uh, you know, that you're at five volts on your board, so you shouldn't have any kind of uh, problems with your game shutting down on you or anything like that. So let's just turn its light back off so you can see the display. And they sell these displays in blue and red and maybe yellow. They sell them in all different colors now, but I like the red, which is kind of uh, generic and basic. You can really read it when the lights are off. So uh, so that's pretty, pretty much it, you know, and uh, again, it just kind of gives you a quick readout on how the status is on your game so but again let's just take one more look if you want to do this yourself the red and white is to the left there as you see it's TP 101 
and right under that to ground the black line is coming off of that and that's going to it's right by TP 107 the ground connector so you put a little dab of solder on it and then just kind of put your lines to it and solder it up so so that's how you do it so um, again thanks for watching my videos I really appreciate the support we just hit 800 subscribers thanks to everybody that subscribed to the channel uh, check out my website www.pinballsupernova.com and with the links to all my other different Pinball Supernova social media sites, Facebook, Twitter, WordPress, which is the blog, and also YouTube. So uh, again, thanks again. Really appreciate it. And talk to you soon.